From January 8, 2025, St. Lucians will need an electronic travel authorization, ETA, to travel to the United Kingdom. St. Lucians can start applying from Wednesday, November 27, 2024. The ETA is a new requirement for travelers to the UK, designed to enhance border security and streamline the travel process. It serves as an advanced travel authorization that must be obtained prior to departure. Scott Frisdom Wood is the British High Commissioner to St. Lucia. This is digitally linked to their passport. Uh, they apply in advance. The charge is, uh, is £10, which is 35 EC dollars. Uh, and once they have that electronic travel authorization, uh, any traveller then can, can travel to the UK multiple times for a two year period, uh, staying for up to six months at a time. It's a system that's used by many countries and, and, and most travellers will be familiar with it already, but we recognise that it's a change, particularly for people who are used to travelling to the UK on a regular basis. So we want to make sure the information is out there early. Frozen Wood says that the length of time for applications to be approved can vary, but typically take a couple of hours. If a St. Lucian is not granted an ETA, he says that they would have to apply for a visa to enter the UK. I hope that there'll be uh, no problems at all. It's a, very, it's a very simple system. It's an online application. It's the sort of system that countries around the world, Australia, uh, Canada, other countries have been using for, for some time. So it's an online application. Uh, it's that £10, 35 EC dollars application fee. And then once you have that, it's electronically linked to your passport. And then you can travel to the UK as many times as you want over the next two years when it would need to be renewed again. In recent years, the electronic travel authorization ETA has been embraced by many countries with the aim of streamlining border control procedures while enhancing security measures for visa exempt visitors. This system has emerged as a vital digital travel document for international travelers. Unlike electronic visas or e-visas, which is an official document issued by the government of a country to allow a foreigner to enter and stay on its territory for a specific period, an ETA is a pre-boarding permission granted by some countries to visa-exempt travelers. The ETA does not replace a visa, but is necessary to enter the destination country. For the DBS News World, Miriam Montout reporting.